problem in transfer pricing in Thailand is that the existing law is outdated. The existing law contains general provisions, which means that these general provisions are used with transactions between unrelated parties, and they are also used for transactions between related parties as well. The existing law can no longer operate effectively to accommodate transfer pricing rules, the so-called arm's length principle. Just to give you an example of some deficiency is currently the revenue officer has the power to uplift the selling price as well as to reduce the expenses. However, they don't have the power to reduce the selling price or to increase expenses. Specific transfer pricing provisions which we introduce will eliminate such frictions and allow the profit of the supply chain to be appropriate allocated among the group companies participating in the same supply chain. The new transfer pricing law will introduce a number of rules. I will categorize these rules into two groups. The first group of rules relate to the requirements for taxpayers to comply with the arm's length principle. The arm's length principle requires taxpayers to set the transfer price to be equal to the market price. The second set of rules relate to the requirements to comply with the disclosure of information relating to the taxpayer adopted transfer pricing practices. There are two steps that taxpayers must disclose the information. The first step is to disclose the information with the annual tax return in the form of transfer pricing disclosure. Second step is in the form of transfer pricing report. The revenue department will use the transfer pricing disclosure form to select audit targets. Once they select the targets, they will review the transfer pricing report in order to make transfer pricing adjustment in the case that the adopted transfer pricing practices of the taxpayer do not comply with the arm's length principle. Many taxpayers are now worried about preparing transfer pricing documentation, but don't forget to review your transfer pricing practices to ensure that the practices comply with the arm's length principle. This is because the, the penalty for failure to comply with the arm's length principle could be in the region of tens or even hundreds of millions of baht compared to the failure to comply with the requirements of the transfer pricing documentation of only 200,000 baht. <laughs>